Hi, number 11. Old Sid used to live there. He was a canny sir. He kept his cell to his cell, never bothered anybody. We called him Old Sid when we were kids, but he was probably only about 50 then. Later on, I walked in the factory with him for a short while when I was an apprentice. We got on our route, although never used to talk much. Not in common, really. Him being an old soldier and me a young modern teenager, I was fed up with hearing stories about the bloody war. Boring. There were more important things to think about then. Fashion, music, football, lasses. <laughs> Especially lasses. He did once tell us a bit about his cell, though. I wasn't really interested, to be honest. But I let him ramble on one tea break when he seemed a bit doon and wanted to talk. He used to live in Asky Road when he was young. He had a girlfriend who lived doing the bankies. That's right on the banks of the Tyne. He used to run along from the Tyne Bridge, under the Redriff Bridge, and down to the Thames, towards Dunstan. He used to play along there when we were kids. There wasn't many hooses left doing there by then. Anyway, he really liked this lass. Even when he got moved to a Kunstler's state up Sheriff Hill, he still kept in touch with her. When he left school, he started working in a factory and was making plans to marry her. But the war started and he got called up. He was only 19. Actually, that shook us a bit. I wasn't much younger myself at the time. I remember I shivered at the thought of fighting and getting killed in a war at that age. I'd only ever watched war films at the pictures. I hadn't realised how young some of the soldiers had been and how many never came back. He lost touch with his last during the war years. When it was all over, he came yeah, and tried to find her. He went down the bankies, but the house had been demolished by the German air raids. They'd bombed that area a lot because of the munitions factories and the shipyards in the banks of the Tyne. He found out her family had all been evacuated to the country. He never found out where, or even if she'd survived. I remember he got pretty upset when he was telling us this. It was embarrassing, really. I didn't know where to look. You didn't expect to see a grown man cry, not during your tea break. Anyway, later on he started courting another lass. They eventually got married, but it didn't work out, and they split up after a couple of years. He just lived on his own now, in number 11 Marley Avenue. But he'd never forgotten his lass on the bankies. He still carried around some old photographs of her. Sad, really. Sometimes I can do to get it To the place where I once used to live And I take a walk to by the bankies And under the old bridge of bridge I remember a house used to stand there And I wasn't much better than a bed When I courted the lassie that lived there and things have changed since then Well I thought that she looked like an angel Dressed in a honey dune clears I can still hear the sound of her laughing I can still see the smile on her face But then we got moved by the council To one of them who's in the states there was no fields and no grassy banks there And I lost track of all my mates But I still used to gandoon and see her As many needs as I could I was determined to keep us together No shit got into me blood I got walk as a factory apprentice And I thought I might ask for a hand Then along came a bloke the Karl Hitler Who put here the army plans I went on and joined in the army They gave us some boots and a gun And I promised them I'd do me duty and fight till the fighting was done I wrote yeah, a stack of love letters 
But what happened, I just can't tell Maybe she never received them Or she made it for somebody else But when I came back again to get it The hoots had been bombed in the war And the family had been moved to the country So I never saw her anymore Well I married another young lassie But we didn't get on our ground In a couple of years we were parted I know I just live on me hand But I've still got a job in the factory It pays for me rent and me beer I suppose me life's quite satisfactory But sometimes I get a bit scared I love that lass on the bankies And that doesn't matter no more But it still brings a tear to me eyes When I sit down and think about her Well I thought that you looked like an angel Dressed in a honey doom clears I can still hear the sound of her laughing I can still see the smile on her face I can still hear the sound of her laughing I can still see the smile on her face Well I thought that she looked like an angel Dressed in a honey dune clears I can still hear the sound of her laughing I can still see the smile on her face